Greater Luxembourg. Let's go. We finally have reached our propaganda, guys. We finally got Greater Luxembourg. This is the map of Luxembourg, including the province of Luxembourg in Belgium. And looking at the point, this looks so beautiful with all the road connections and all. Let's go. The Iberian Crisis in 2050. So, Portugal remains Portugal. Well, yeah. Uh, Galicia gets their independence. Catalonia gets their independence. But these two provinces, I'm not going to even try to name them. Asturias and Cantabria gets independence too. Navarre and Aragon also gets independence. And France takes some stuff and also loses some stuff. What? Okay, and Andorra just ceases to exist. Andorra, I think, becomes part of Catalonia. So yeah, this is a pretty messed up Spain. This is a Spanish crisis, that's true. Map of France, if you can include only the French ethnic groups. Meaning, if France only included all the French-speaking areas. So, you take some part from Spain. Okay, and... It, you just okay. Uh, just Belgium ceases to exist. They take uh, Valonia, and I think that goes to Netherlands. Uh, Luxembourg and Alsace Lorraine has gone to Germany. Okay, and they ch took a whole chunk out of Switzerland. I think Switzerland doesn't even exist now. Germany is now thick, <laughs> including all the land they're getting. <laughs> they might even get Austria, which is actually uh, not allowed by the treaty of World War II. Ow. Okay, I was not expecting this. I actually thought they would get even more than that. They don't have Corsica? Okay, okay, fair enough. What if the crusade in 1230 actually succeeded? So it was one of the crusades that were very close in succeeding, but it, it didn't work at the end. So the main purpose of each crusade was to get control of all the holy cities, which is Alexandria and uh, obviously Jerusalem and Antioch. Where's Antioch? Yeah, Antioch. So uh, I think they got all these regions back from the Sultanate, and uh, for once the Crusade succeeded. <laughs> or Japan had the same fate of Germany after World War Two, and looking at this why is korea united okay <laughs> and it's still the 1940s and uh, let's say 49 i think so and we have a uh, northern japan and a southern japan but having a east tokyo and a west tokyo what <laughs> okay look uh, to all fairness this flag rocks this flag is so good i'm so this flag is Straight of the arc. So rather like uh, East and West Germany, the capitalist part was inside the communist part. In this, the communist part is inside the capitalist part. So we can see that. Uh, here there's the Tokyo Wall and 1990 is going to be a very fun year. Because we are going to see uh, two countries' wall get broken. <laughs> What if the caliphate actually turns into the Soviet Union? What? <laughs> so, this, it's like all the major Islamic countries coming together, forming the Soviet Union or the, or the communist thingy, I think so. And uh, uh, Riyadh is the capital, I think so. No, it's not. Uh, uh, sorry, the uh, Cairo is the capital of this union, containing these of oh, AS. Yes, well, still, it's really, really disturbing to see that. Uh, I just it doesn't feel right. Like all these nations and just Israel being Israel. Well, they're just there. <laughs> they're just there. <laughs> And uh, there's some kind of civil war happened in Congo. What the hell happened here? The Democratic Republic of Congo 
correct by the Republic of Congo, I think so. Yeah. Cool CJ 1410, cool CJ 1410, cool CJ, cool CJ.